Hey, welcome back to Triple R. Today we're going to take a look at Moto RKD Dash. It's on Steam for like $2.99 right now. Pretty sure I got it on sale for like $0.99. Cents. I would say it's worth more than $0.99 cents than $3. Bucks. Um, still got my money's worth. Even $3, bucks, I wouldn't be super disappointed because it plays plays well. There's a level of difficulty. Um, it's very simple, simple gameplay. So it has some cool music, some cool visuals. Let's check it out. So it's one map, you go left, right, you're going to shift up with a Y, an Xbox controller, or Xbox knockoff controller. So you got a score, you get near misses, perfect runs, so on and so on. And you're going to have a fuel limit, you got to keep an eye on make sure you get the, to the next checkpoint in time. So 60 seconds of fuel, etc, etc. Let's get started here. So we'll run through the first leg of the level. And then a little bit of the second level. Three, it's eight to start. Two, one. And you um, auto accelerate. So once you hit the turbo like twice and you're in this mode here, you just have to worry about going left and right. And you know, not hitting anything. This first level is pretty easy. Once you get the hang of it. It's all kind of like this downhill continuous perspective. So it kind of leans to the side. Uh, I feel like I'm moving my head to the side. I can't tell. I have to watch, watch the playback, I guess. Um, but you can, say, you can see it's pretty simple. Got a pretty good sense of speed. I know you that. You can shift back up. And your turbo on the lower uh, right hand side there. Fuel's getting pretty low, so it should be towards the end of the level. Um, maybe. So I barely made that because I wrecked once. Let's go to the next race. And the environments do change pretty, pretty um, different from each other. Three. Two more like a force level. Time to hit that turbo like right away so you can start getting as, as fast as you can as fast as you can. Uh, that's some nice tracks. The music fits the gameplay. And just gotta be careful not to hit anybody. And I think the next one might be like, kind of like a beach level. In case you do want to play, so I'm going to score a bunch of levels because I think it's pretty short, even though I haven't beat it. I think I've got the level four or five. So I'm currently stuck there. There's just a lot of um, just memorization. Like that one has abilities that come into the track a little bit, so you have to go like left and right and avoid the other cycle. Other cycles there. So, pretty fun little game. I like this kind of stuff. I don't really want to compare it to like Retro Wave because it's not an endless runner. It does have a point, like a map track you're trying to accomplish. It's like kind of like better, I think. So that went pretty quick, so we'll check out track three here. Yeah, there's the, there's the water effect. It's not great. Three, two, one. There you go. So you want to tap Y and get to. The second turbo level, you know, as fast as possible. So I'm gonna go ahead and wreck so you can see the map, and then that's, that'll be pretty much the entire uh, not mechanics, but the things in the game besides how different levels look and play. So that's all you're gonna see. You're gonna see left, right of your motorcycle, your fuel, you can downshift with A. Runs out as quick as you wanted to. And you trip down there, I think you're thinking for 60 each time. Well, we'll see a little more of the track. I'm not, I shouldn't be able to make it. Yeah, I won't be able to make it now. But up there has some like a fuel gauge and a battery gauge. I don't think that does anything. It's just for show. You know, when you get hit. 
I'll go to game over screen. This will be the map of your goals. So in the blue, that's what we achieved. Got the you know the start for the second. We're in the third leg there. And it looks like there's like, like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, like eight more legs. Actually probably nine. If you go to the gold over there. So I usually get stuck right about Ocean Gate after Ocean Gate, I think is where I'm stuck at. But not a bad game. If you like this type of stuff, it's three bucks. I would probably wait for a sale. This is Moto RKD SP. Thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night, wherever you are.